You with Dallas Food Critic. I'm on Bodyguard TV. And tonight we in Deep Ellum, right by downtown Dallas. And we checking out Vidora. Heard this is one of the late night spots. After 10 o'clock to come and eat, get you some good margaritas. Nice late night vibe. So we finna go check it out. You with Dallas Food Critic. I'm on Bodyguard TV. Y'all come roll with me. I'm here. is amazing ambiance you got downtown dallas right there ain't nothing better i recommend anybody to come to fedora just to kick it lay back and chill you on bodyguard tv and we're bringing you all the lit reviews on dallas food critics stay tuned Dallas food critic. I'm at Vidora and we're here with Rosa. Rosa, let us know a little bit about the Red Berea tacos and everything else that we ordered. Okay, so right here we have the Birria tacos made with uh, brisket and uh, cheese. And then it's served with our consomme sauce as well. We have our street tacos, which is trompo uh, beef, barbacoa, carnitas. And on this side we have chicken tinga, trompo, and carnitas. Awesome, awesome. I'm so excited, Rosa, to try y'all street tacos and the barilla tacos. Vidora got it going on as far as the late night vibes. Thank you so much, Rosa. You were Dallas, Dallas food critic. I'm on Bodyguard TV. Stay tuned. These street tacos ain't all that. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Be real, bro. It's dry. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's hard on the outside. Meat ain't even that moist. I just feel like I'm just chewing through shit. But. I mean, they ain't worth three dollars. Maybe a dollar fifty a taco, maybe two for three. But they winning like a hoe. Now I can't mention none of the rest of the food, but these tacos, these street tacos, ain't what's up. The real tacos, I right, but I'm not gonna tell somebody to come to these two shit. But hey, I'm honest. Nothing else I got to say about it. Tomorrow we was right. Don't come here for the food. We're not the street type. That's 
time I had. And I'm just hungry. I give it two stars, if that. Y'all gonna lie to y'all, bro. It wasn't cheap. But I gotta be real. Not the fucking best tacos I've ever had in my life. But look, nice vibe. I got one more taco on the chicken. Just a, uh, a beef trumpo. Whatever the fuck that is. This is a trumpo beef. Let's check it out. I've had better. Way better. They bullshitting me on these tacos, man. You know what I'm saying? You crack a smile, yeah. But, meat tough. I'm chewing too much. I don't mind all that, man. I'm not, I'm not messing with these Vidora Street tacos, man. I'm not, I'm not raving about it, so, you know. I'm gonna set that taco down. I don't even want to finish that. We're gonna go last but not least. This should be the. Carnitas? A little bit better, but. Literally, none of the street tacos are actually here. Only the burrito taco, maybe because it's the braised beef, but. I think it was only moist because I dipped it in the soup. Overall, the food was just so so. Margarita is okay, but the vibe is what's right. That's probably it. Do Dallas Food Critic? Gotta give y'all the real. Stay tuned on Bodyguard TV. You with Dallas Food Critic? Appreciate y'all tuning in. Going to Vidor, really dropped the ball. I give them two stars, if that. Like I said, tacos were dry to meat. Meat was cold. I mean, it just was just wasn't what's up. As far as street tacos go, you gotta have the fresh onions and cilantro and all of that. But just overall, not worth three dollars. Fifty cents, two for a dollar. That's what I would give them. There's other spots, Taco Bell, Taco Cabana, that probably would have gave me a better taco. I'm not finna just sit here and lie. They could have done better, but as far as the vibe and ambiance, eat before you go and then go with a fifty dollar margarita. And with no buzz attached to it, not with it. But hey, I'm going to give y'all the live lit reviews, let y'all know the real. You been tuned in with Dallas Food Critic. I appreciate y'all watching. Got new reviews coming soon.